they want to end the contract. And without you, nothing makes sense. So this one double-sided. Some cards are not double-sided. Uh, this one is. So I'm going to do these separate. They went to end the contract. <clears throat> Excuse me. There may be some kind of communication blockages in this energy. Death and the maiden. Invasion. Boundaries violated. Dominance. Someone may be trying to have some kind of dominance or power control. There's an ending, death in the maiden. Um, Pluto just went direct too. Those of you guys know about Pluto energy, endings, transformations, rebirths, power, um, control. So whoever you're trying to end something with or end a contract with, that person may be invading your privacy. Um, Violating your boundaries or trying to have dominance and dictatorship or control over the situation. Nine of Swords, Two of Cups, Two of Wands. Okay, this person is real nervous because you're possibly having a relationship with someone else, maybe an affair with someone else or you're going towards someone else that you have some kind of attraction to or friendship with, you get on well. You get on well with someone, two of wands, two of cups. You're possibly about to leave a home. Some of y'all, this is you ending a soul contract. Spiritual divorce. Yeah, you could be ending a soul contract. They're finalizing things in the spirit realm. It's it's going to be finalized in the spirit realm before it's like a final thing in the material world. Five of Swords reversed. Four of Pentacles. This is someone trying to have control and hold on to you. They may be trying to hold on to you for security. Page of Cups. Yeah, there's a love interest. Someone's there's someone new or someone's getting back with someone. There's a there's some love here. Someone could be uh, exchanging loving messages, flirting, texting back and forth, dating. Five of Cups. Someone is sad, emotional. Four of Wands. Yeah, they're, they could be with a soulmate or a twin flame, or there was a celebration, a party, or someone met at a party. Someone's in some Four of Wands energy. They're possibly going to someone else's house, maybe moving in with someone else. The Four of Wands, Two Wands. Or attending an event together or something like that. They want a divorce, Spirit says. Seven of Pentacles reversed. Somebody wants a divorce. They're not changing their mind. Someone's like real firm on that. They're, that's what they're giving me. Like they want a divorce. It's, it's final. Like they're not changing their mind. They're serious about that. I just heard something like, I don't want to be with you no more. Someone don't want to be with someone no more. Ten of Pentacles. This may be a family or a marriage or you guys have a, a long life you've built together. Or you've been together for uh, maybe a decade. There could have been someone fighting a lot. Drama, argue, a lot of arguments. A lot of differences going back and forth. The tower, 
Yeah, um, it's the tower here. Mars, this is this. I'm seeing like Mars and Libra, so this may be a relationship coming down. This could be a, um, yeah, a marriage that's ending. Could be or a living situation or something. Could be a um a contract with a business or a job. King of Pentacles, that may be someone in the workforce or a business person, businessman. Someone could not want to be tied to someone anymore financially. That may be a husband or a father. What else, Spirit? They want to end the contract. Walking away. Someone's walking away. Archangel Metatron. This is the third eye chakra. Someone's inner voice or intuition could be telling them to walk away or move on or to end something. Someone. Okay. I'm also seeing like. Someone is getting worse and worse in someone's situation or environment. Someone that they're living with is invading their space. They're watching them or something, and they know about it. They're watching them or stalking them or going through their phone. They're going, they're being nosy and stuff. It's, it's like driving someone away. Some kind of, something with invasion. Yeah, contract just popped out. Look. Contract. Contract reverse. Yeah. That's a clear sign right there. Someone's ending the contract for sure. Yeah. They're always watching them. Spirit says they could be in the same home, always watching them and stuff. Oh my God, that's a lot that came out. Lease or rent. Someone could be leasing something or leasing a home together, renting, or they're about to go find their own place or something, or get on another um, contract. Be patient. Be patient just came out. Be patient. This is, look, this is confirmation. Some of y'all, this is confirmation that they are your soulmates. This is confirmation. God is about to drop you a miracle that will cancel every your every worry. Dang. Sometimes being soft is strong. Somebody could be feeling soft, emotional, vulnerable, emotion, yeah, emotional or something. Sensitive. Yeah, someone's possibly get, about to get off of a lease or um, a lease or something. Dang. That or they're about to get on a lease. They could, yeah. They, whatever this is, they're not invested into that no more. I see why this person's nervous now. Nine of Swords, Five of Cups. I'm just getting a sense like they're about to go live somewhere else or with someone else. There's someone in this Two of Cups energy they're focused on. Some male change, journey, yeah. Some man or some man or male or masculine energy is about to change course, change path, go live somewhere else. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm sensing like a, a blocked throat chakra here. Someone's been blocking communication or the truth. Some of y'all are about to get unblocked.
Dang. Change, journey, main mail. What does this man want to communicate that wants to end a contract or some soul contracts? He said, live and learn. He lived and learned, experienced training development. He got some kind of wisdom. Memories. There could be some kind of memories, remembrance, reunion, commemoration. This person could be learning from the past memories or learning from some past experiences. Conflict. They could be fighting and stuff. To me, all this is two males or two men living together. Different disputation, quarrel. Maybe there's been a, yeah, this five of swords reversed. There's been some drama or fighting or something. What is, show us more with this third eye chakra. Natural disaster reversed. This person possibly didn't want to take a risk before in the past. They 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 could be getting out of survival mode. Okay, some karma is playing out or justice is playing out, or this is something with some skills balancing out. It could be something with the courts or the law. Equality, neutrality, logic. They could be going to court to end a contract out. Yeah, Spear says, a lot of you guys are wondering. Spear says, yes, he's moving. Yes, he's moving. He's moving. He's moving. Ace of Pentacles, some kind of offer. The universe has given him some kind of opportunity or, or uh, this is his time to move or change or some kind of journey. He's manifesting this. Ace of Pentacles, maturity. He's been maturing possibly. Yeah, he's about to do something. Friendliness reverse, two cups reverse. He could be ending out a relationship with someone or ending out a friendship. Or someone's unfriendly. They're not friendly. There's some issues between him and someone else. They're beefing and stuff. Or there's tension. Or they're not getting along. Too many differences. Oh, yeah. Here. There you go. Completion. This hit this right here. Completion. This done. You see the... Um, I didn't show this because she's naked. Um, something's done. Death. Invasion. Boundaries violated. 28. The world. Yeah. Some of you guys, this person could feel like you're their missing puzzle piece. You're, the, you're, you're what's missing in their life. 